Hey guys, it's Garage Taylor Vaughn here, and <laughs> I'm sorry I haven't posted a video in, it's been years now. I have been living abroad and whatnot, so but since so much time has gone by, I figured I would have a video answering everybody's questions because I have not answered questions in so long. So I put a list together of a bunch of questions uh, that a lot of you guys have asked, and I figured for this video I would go ahead and answer them. These questions are all relating to eBay buying, selling, my channel, all general questions that I've gotten on all of my videos. The first question, Christina A. asked, do you still sell on eBay? And I do still sell on eBay. Um, when I've been abroad and whatnot, I've stopped, but yes, I have my full production up and running now. Okay, Vaughn Scrapper says, how much does it cost for you to ship jeans, and how do you ship them? I think I actually made a video on how to ship jeans. Uh, that you should go check out if you want to, but it costs me now, I believe, about six dollars in total for everything to ship jeans, and I ship in a priority flat rate envelope, uh, sometimes the larger one, sometimes the smaller one. Um, they have two different sizes, the regular and the legal size, and I normally find that the cheapest way, but as of recently, uh, first class is now going up to 16 ounces instead of 13, so sometimes for women's uh, jeans or pants they are 16 ounces or less so it's much cheaper to ship first class than priority okay so the next question is from life is now and life is now asks how did you learn what jeans to get trial and error and the answer to that is absolutely trial and error I mean I follow a lot of brands pretty closely so I know which brands to look for um, you have to try things out and see how they go some things go really well better than expected and some things don't um, but I just have a lot of experience but my recommendation for new people coming into this is you just need to give it a shot and you know uh, in, the, in the long run if you're smart you're gonna make money so Yes, trial and error is the best way to do it. Uh, as of now, I know a lot of good brands um, that I stick with and I follow whether they do well or not. So, yeah. Next question is from Vince Ciadella. And Vince says, do men's jeans sell better than women's? And the, qu the answer to that is yes, men's jeans often sell better. I'm not sure why. Um, but yes, men's jeans sell quite a bit better. So if you can, find men's jeans. Next question is from Chai Latte. How long do you roughly spend in each thrift store? Uh, when I am in thrift stores, I go through things pretty thoroughly. I look at all the branding tags as well as the price tags. And for almost every single thing, um, because I like to, I don't want to miss anything. So I'm pretty thorough. So I would say an hour or two maybe. Next question is from uh, Fivi Chikfa. <laughs> and that person asks what is BIN or BIN and that is like I guess eBay terminology for a buy it now auction first or a buy it now listing versus a listing auction if you don't know what that is it's when you have a price and that's the price that people pay or they don't buy it versus an auction is a starting price and then it bids up next question is from David McClelland do you wait and sell your button-down long sleeves in the winter, or are you going to go ahead and sell them now when you buy them? And my answer to that is I don't like to keep any inventory. I like to have it all listed as soon as I get it. Next question is from Trent Todd Hunter, and that is, what is your eBay name? It is GS Vaughn underscore YTV, and that stands for Garage Sailor Vaughn YouTube. Uh, you guys should definitely go and check out my listings if you want, if you want to see how exactly I do them, if you want to see like how I do my photos and what I write in the listing, go ahead. Uh, especially my description too, that's really important. Go ahead and check out my listings. Next question is from Milk Cap. Uh, Milk Cap says, Vaughn, do you ever have excess inventory or items that won't sell? How do you get rid of them quickly? Yes, I have a lot of items that... Uh, take a while to sell. I, I normally don't keep anything for more than like a month or two, but um, I just lower the price, lower the price until it's not worth like shipping, and then I give it away. Next question is from Castle's Corner. Do you sell your items, buy it now or auction? Which one do you think is better for clothing? I prefer to do buy it now, um, but I could do a whole video of the differences between doing buy it now or auction style listings, but I prefer buy it now. That's what all mine are. Occasionally, I'll do auction style, but 
it depends on a lot of things, but buy it now is very simple for me because it's easiest when you have a lot of items for sale, in my opinion. Next question is from Team Picker. Uh, how do you know if something is silver? Um, silver has basic marks on it in general, like commonly. They don't. It doesn't always, but in general, it does. It, it's marked ster or sterling or nine two five, which means sterling. That's the purity level of the silver. Ninety two point five percent silver. Um, so yes, please comment anything you have to say below. I'll try to respond to uh, a lot of the comments that I have. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I hope you guys have a good day.